Okay, so today we're going to figure out how to find the start time or the ending time, depending on the situation. So let's start by trying to find the ending time. So let's say we start at 3.15 and it takes you 20 minutes to do your homework, 15 minutes to eat, but what time are you going to end? So our strategy is going to be the same. We're going to use a number line and our starting time is right here. We're missing our ending time. So we start at 3.15 and since we go this way to the right, we're going to add to it. We're adding 20 minutes and you can always add 10 at a time if you want. So 315 plus 10 is 325 plus 10. That's 335. Now we're missing 15 minutes to eat. We got 10, 20 for homework. So let's add 10. That's 345. And all we're missing is five more. 45 plus five is 350. So we start at 315, 20 minutes to eat. That's 335 plus 15 minutes for, sorry, 20 minutes for homework, 15 minutes to eat. That's 350. So we're using addition, but what happens if we need the starting time? Now we have the ending time, which is right here at 6.55. On the number line, when we go to the left, we subtract. So instead of adding, I'm going to be subtracting 32 minutes for PlayStation and 15 minutes for reading. So you start taking away and it's up to you. I'm going to first take away 15 minutes, so 10. 55 minus 10 is 6. 45 minus 5. 45 minus 5 is 6. 40. Now we need to take away 32. So I'm going to take away 10. 6, 30, minus 10, 6, 20, minus 10, 6, 10, and that's 10, 20, 30, I'm missing 2, minus 2, 10 minus 2 is going to be 6, oh, 8. So if I ended at 6.55, at what time did I begin play, um, PlayStation and reading? I began at 6.08. So again, you have the starting time, but we're missing the ending time. You add how many minutes it took you to do whatever activity you're doing. I need to add 18, so I'm going to add 10. And then I'm going to add 8. My answer is 548. But when we go back, We take away 26. I want to go to the beginning. So I go back in time. Minus 26. Let's take away 10. Take away 10. So that's 10, 20. I need to take away 6. 8 minus 6 is going to be 2, 22. So that's 10, 
22. So in conclusion, review, when you're missing the ending, what do you do? You add. But when you're missing that start, you subtract. You take away the elapsed time.